Hey everyone, it's Dusty Monkey here. I haven't got the McNuggets with me just now. They're away visiting their gram uh, because it's the summer holidays here in Scotland. So it'll just be a little me and I got a surprise today. I wasn't expecting it today. So I am going to show you what I got. There's a big hint in the background, by the way. I got Geek Gear. As you can see, Geek Gear, yes. Um, yeah, I'm quite happy. It's it's weighty. I mean, it weighs a ton. I'd say a mug ton. So yeah, I'm not even sure which month this is. I'm assuming it's July's month. So we're gonna have to give it a try. Open it up. It's been a while since I've got a Geek Gear. My wife's been getting the World of Wizardry ones, so we will continue to get that. Um, and I will do those unboxings as and when they come in too. Um, and the wearable ones. We're gonna start doing the wearable ones, which has just well uh, clues and title wearable stuff. Um, so we're going to do them as well. So more unboxings coming for me and hopefully more of the McNuggets too. So here's the Geek Gear, I assume for July. So there you go. Let's give it an open and see what's inside. I love these boxes. Uh, oh, it didn't open properly. There we go. It's open. It's open. We've got blue paper, people. Blue paper. Be prepared. Let's see. Uh, Okay, this is interesting. It is the July one, based on the magazine saying July. And there's lots of weapons in the front, different types of weapons. We're not gonna go through the book yet. We'll keep that as a surprise. Let's have a look. I think I was right about the weight, so we'll start with that. Oh, no, I wasn't. I was wrong. It does happen, don't tell the wife. This is a Star Wars money box. So yeah. The Force Awakens, so it's a newer one. Um, I'm not huge into Star Wars, but it's weighty. It, it's like China. It's made out of like a cup, but like porcelainy type. So we'll give that an open. Have a look. This might be handy for saving all those extra pennies. Um, so yeah, there we go. It's just got the evil peoples, the dark side all around it. Um, so. Don't know how encouraging that is, but yeah, cool. It's it's quite heavy. It just feels like a mug, so that's why I thought it was a mug. So I'll put that away. Oh, now this is useful. The next item is extremely useful for today's current climate. It's a Star Wars umbrella. That actually might get used in the next I don't know half an hour after this video. It's quite a big umbrella too. Um. I'm not going to open it because it's bad luck to open an umbrella inside. So what I'm going to do is, when I'm out meeting the missus from work, I will get her to take a picture, um, and you will see this picture. But that that's quite a nice solid feeling umbrella. I quite like that. That's nice. Yeah, good good going. Oh, it's decorated inside too. Look, inside print. That's nice. I'm going to have to try that today. Uh, okay, we're going to go with the t-shirt now. Oh, no, that's cool. I would wear that. It's uh, Captain Jack Sparrow. We all recognise that face. It's Pirates of the Caribbean. That's a nice t-shirt. It feels nice, too. Um, that's quite good. I'm going to have to give that a wear, I think. You may see that featured in the next video. Um, we've got this. Uh, Game of Thrones book. It's, I think this might just be like a... Yeah, it's just a plain notebook. But, considering Game of Thrones just restarted, so it's very topical. We've got... We've got a map of the kingdoms in the notebook, which is quite nice. It's quite cool. Um, and it's just an A5 book. And there's a map of the other side too. So we've got two maps of the kingdoms. But that's quite topical, quite good for... Um, considering Game of Thrones just started in July, so that's quite good. Kudos to them. Ooh. Now, I noticed my wife got, and my daughter, because she's got three months of the World of Wizardry box, got something. And uh, they guess they've started doing this, but it's an enamel pin. Nice. It looks like I got... I don't know if I got the normal one or if I got the special one. So there's three types they're doing. Um, there's the classic, the silver, and the gold edition. Now, I'm not too sure... 
um, which one I got because it kind of all looked the same. Oh, that's not showing up very well. Yep, I'm not sure whether I got the which one I got. Um, whether I got the silver or the classic, it's difficult to tell. But that looks like a nice pin badge. I'm gonna have to get some kind of tablecloth, uh, sort of tea tea cloth or something, and I'll pin it up there behind me, and I'm gonna start putting all the pins on it. That's what I'll do, because that could be quite cool. That's nice. I'll need to see if I can ask them which one I got, because it's difficult to tell. So the, there's one in 50 chance of getting a silver, and one in 100 chance of getting the gold. So that's the same as the Harry Potter ones, or the World of Wizardry ones, should I say. They um, they have the classic, the silver and the gold edition too. Uh, my daughter and my wife got the classic for a wee Harry Potter pin, which is quite cute. So yeah, I'll have to p start pinning them up. Uh, there's a keyring which is quite heavy. It's got a D BB-8. I'm sure we've seen many like them. It's Disney, obviously. Uh, we've got a wee set of vinyl stickers, which I'll put on the side of my desk where I put all of them, all the others. Uh, you'll recognise this fellow. Uh. Got to fight it out of the box though. Right out of the box. He knows nothing about anything, but he still managed to win everything. So that's Jon Snow, Warden of the North, King of the North. Depending on which series you're on, you might just be one of the 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 Black Army. Well, what are they called? I can't remember. Um, so yeah, Night's Watch. That's it, the Night's Watch. He might just be one of the Night's Watch to you. But, yeah. So that's that's everything. That was July's box. Let's have a quick look through the magazine. And we'll pile all them in together. I like the umbrella. The umbrella's probably my favourite. And maybe the pin. I'm liking the pin. Um, get that all in. And I like the notebook. I always like a notebook. I have a lot of community based meetings that I love and love a notebook so um so let's have a quick flick through the bookie and um, they've really increased the quality since I, I did a video of their um of their books actually I quite like it it's really nice paper so there's the wee thank you message and then we've got the iconic pirate t-shirt um Then we had the Star Wars umbrella, the Game of Thrones Jon Snow print, uh, we've got the Pirates of the Caribbean vinyl stickers, oh there was, was see the full power, the Force Awakens money box, um, then there was the the choice of the, the pin badges um, and that's how you get a hold of them Instagram etc etc um, so they've also got what they're also doing is highlighting youtubers like myself who do videos which is a really nice thing to give back um, so I'm going to check her out uh, Mona Felicis um, then we've got I Love Geek Gear winners who have taken pictures with their goodies that they got. Got some lovely faces out there. Some great poses. And the prizes for the this month's Geek Gear box we're giving away 50 intricately detailed Game of Thrones dragon sculptures from the Noble Collection. You can hear the guinea pigs in the background there. For your chance to win, upload an image of yourself with the I Love Geek Gear. Winners are published in our magazine will automatically win one intricately detailed Game of Thrones dragon sculpture. So that's the three dragon sculptures you can win. Um, so those three there get, get one of the dragons, which is cool. Um, next box, next month's box theme is retro. So we're going to get to see that soon. The end of August. That'll be out to retro gaming. And there we go. 
So, let's review what we got. One book, which has all the info in it. We got our Pirate of the Caribbean vinyl stickers. We got a Star Wars money bank, money bank. An amazing Star Wars umbrella, which is extremely useful at the moment. One Game of Thrones notebook with a map of Westeros or whatever the whole land is called. A pin, wolf pin, and I'm still not sure whether it's the silver or the normal. We've got a BB-8 keyring. Picture of Le Jon Snow. I think I'm better looking with a better beard. And we've got the t-shirt, which I quite like. Um, so yeah, let me know what you thought of the box. Um, I recently was able to meet the director of Geek Gear at a gaming convention, which was just awesome. Really lovely guy. I also had the chance to visit the shop um, that they have um, in Falkirk, which is in Scotland. And it's an amazing wee shop. Love it. I took a 360 um, picture of their whole shop. So if you want, check out on Facebook, Dusty Monkey MacD, and you will see the picture on my Facebook page there uh, of the whole shop, and you'll see all of us in the shop with it. Um, I had PJ, who you'll know from my previous videos, holding the camera and me taking a picture. So yeah, check that out, and be sure to check back, and keep an eye out for my live streams. I'm doing a lot more live streaming via Facebook, uh, via YouTube, and enjoy the rest of August. Catch us next time. Have a great day. See ya. Bye.